Hi there everybody, this is Miss Nelson here and today we are doing lesson 4.11 in our 4th grade Florida Go math book. Lesson 4.11 is called Divide by One Digit Numbers and today is probably my favorite lesson because we get to just finally do traditional long division. So when I um, teach my kids how to do long division, I teach them the mnemonic does McDonald's serve burgers, which basically tells them the steps that they need to do in order to divide, to divide and get the quotient. So the first step would be divide, then multiply, then subtract, then bring down. So divide, multiply, subtract, bring down. And then you would just start over with that process until you've used all of your numbers. So let me go ahead and model that for you. First, I asked myself, and we're right here, 8,523 divided by 8. I asked myself, how many times does 8 fit into 8? That's my division question. 8 fits into 8 one time. Finish with my division. Finish with my first step. So then I move to multiplying. 1 times 8 is 8. Then I subtract. 8 minus 8 is 0. Then I bring down now I have a 5 down here. Then I just start over with divide, with the last thing I wrote. So I ask myself, how many times does 8 fit into 5? It doesn't fit in at all, so I write a 0. Then I multiply. 0 times 8 is 0. Then I subtract. 5 minus 0 is 5. Then I bring down. So now I have 52 down here. And I start over again. So I'm dividing into what I last wrote. How many times does 8 fit into 52? It fits in 6 times. Then I multiply. 6 times 8 is 48. Then I subtract. So 52 minus 48 is 4. Then I bring down. So now I have 43 down here, and I'm going to start over with dividing. So how many times does 8 fit into my 43? It fits in 5 times. 5 times 8 is 40. Then I subtract. 43 minus 40 is 3. Then my next step would be bring down, but there's nothing else to bring down. So I'm done. This that was left down here, that is my remainder of 3. So my answer is 1,065 remainder 3. So this is just your traditional way to divide. The easiest and most practical way, I think. And you can remind yourself of the steps by thinking, does McDonald's serve burgers? Which is divide, multiply, subtract, and bring down. And you just have to keep doing those processes, those Divide, multiply, subtract, bring down until you run out of numbers. Okay, so if you're in my class, I'd like you to write down the password squirrel in your planner. That lets me know you watched this video. And if you have any questions, just please leave me a message. Thanks.